Hey guys, welcome to Tech Surgeon YT once again. So today in this video, I'm going to be introducing a platform that is changing the way we all think about AI voices and it's called Fish Audio. So whether you're a content creator, a student, a developer, or you're just a person that is very curious about AI, this tool, Fish Audio, is going to allow you to create insanely realistic voices. You can clone your own voice in seconds, and you can also use these voices in real time. It is fast, it is flexible, and it's surprisingly easy to use. And I'm going to be showing you guys exactly how to get started and make the most of this platform. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to come to the fish.audio platform. And then once you're on the fish.audio platform, you're going to create an account on the platform it is free to use and you can just use a free plan before migrating to the premium plan so now i'm going to be logging into my account you can create an account using github or you can also create an account using google or if you don't want to use your google account you can just tap on go to create right here tap in your email address tap in your password you're going to be sending code and then you can log into the account so now since i already have an account i'm going to come to log in and then i'm going to be logging in directly into my account now the first thing you're going to notice when you're on the dashboard of this platform is this platform has no clutter it is very easy to use once you get on the platform you know exactly how to use the platform so you can see that there are three key things on the home page you can see the text to speech you can see the voice cloning and then you can also see the speech to text so now we are going to be testing the text to speech feature and now we are going to be using elon musk voice and instead of using the generic script right here we are going to be generating a script that elon musk will say so i'm just going to come to chat gpt right now and i'm going to type in general okay so we're just going to copy this and then we're going to be dropping it on the platform and then you can just play that it's important to push the boundaries of what's possible otherwise we're just standing still humanity needs to become a multi-planetary species so you guys can see how insanely realistic that sounds and then we can use the same script for any of these other voices so let's as my change this to donald j trump and i can just post the exact same script and then play that in his voice i think it's important to push the boundaries of what's possible otherwise we're just standing still humanity needs to become a multi-planetary species so you guys can hear how insanely realistic that sounds and that's not even the end of it because this has more insane features and they were going to be checking all of that in this video now you can come to the voice cloning tab where basically you can upload your own voice on this platform and then clone that and use that in future instances and there's also the speech to text feature and this is very important for people that have meetings or students that have classes so let's assume you record a lecturer's speech during the class all you have to do is come here you can just upload the audio file of your lecturer talking and then it's going to generate the full written iteration of that audio so now we're going to be testing this with an audio file that i have kept on my laptop so i'm going to tap on upload audio and then we're just going to be picking this audio from madara uchiha and then you can see that that generated in less than three seconds you can see this is everything that was contained in the audio file and it has just turned this into text so basically you can upload any audio you want and then you can turn it to text in less than three seconds so now let's dive deep into the platform so the first thing we are greeted with on the top menu is the discovery tab and now on the discovery tab you can see you have a lot of model voices you can see these are the recommended voices which are some of the most used voices you can see the spongebob squarepants audio voice with over 176,000 people using this voice you can see the 11 labs adam voice you can see a lot of other voices right here with a lot of people using these voices and then you can also upload your voice right here and that brings us to the second menu now, the second menu is the text to speech tab and on the text to speech tab you can create instant speeches that's short phrases or you can also create an advanced audio story now i'm not going to be dwelling so much on the instant speech tab because it is pretty safe explanatory so all you have to do is tap on the start from scratch tab and then you can just tap any speech you want i'm just going to be copying the same speech i had before so you can just tap on that and then you can select a voice to say this 
text right here so i'm just going to be picking elon musk as my voice again since this is his script and then you can pick the model the voice model you want to be using if you want to be using the version 1.5 the version 1.6 or the s1 the s1 model is the best model out right now so it is very advisable to use that and then you can see the advanced settings which allows you to control the volume the speed and the temperature of your speech recording so now Another feature I really like about this platform, and it is also their latest addition to the platform, is the fact that you can add expressions in between your text. I can come to the beginner right here, tap on this expressive tab, and then I can allow him to have emotions during the speech. So at the beginning of the speech, I can just put angry emotions, and let's say it gets calmer at the end. So we can just put relaxed at the end. Let's say around the middle of the script, let's say before it gets to the calm phase, is a little bit uh anxious so now you can just generate this and then play this and then you're going to hear every of these emotions and every of these expressions being played throughout the entirety of the audio i think it's important to push the boundaries of what's possible otherwise we're just standing still humanity needs to become a multi-planetary species not just for exploration but for survival if something's important enough so when we started the playback you can see it started with a more angry tone then it got more anxious and then at the end it was going to get more relaxed so now we are coming back to this text to speech tab and then we are going to be going to the advanced audio story which i found more fascinating so all we had to do is tap on start from scratch we are going to put a project name so i'm going to be putting projects alpha and then for our default voice on this script, I'm going to be using this eagle voice. So I'm going to be selecting an eagle voice and then we're going to be using the S1 model and then just tap on create. So now you can see right here, this is partitioned into chapters. So you can come to this plus tab right here to add more chapters. So basically the advanced tab just allows you to create more complicated speeches and can even allow you to create dialogue now for this demonstration i'm going to be generating a quick speech now generate this you can pause this as the first part of the dialogue you can come to the next and then for the next part of the dialogue you can just pick the old man's dialogue you can place that there so basically what we are creating here is consistency you can see we are creating consistency in the dialogue using different characters so you can use more than two characters you can create speeches between four to five characters if you want so you can use this to create whole stories now you can see right here she is voicing every single dialogue so if you want to change this all you have to do is tap on the profile picture right here and then i can change this dialogue to be david's voice which is an old band so david is going to take this part of the dialogue and then you can tap on the last part of the dialogue and david is also taking the last part of the dialogue they are going to tap on generate this so omg hey grandpa do you even know what tiktok is tiktok i thought that was the sound my clock made before i threw it out in lol you're hilarious do you even use emojis i use punctuation does that count so you can see that that was kind of slow piece that's why you have this advanced settings tab right there you can use it to make the speech faster and you can also use it to reduce or increase the volume of the speech so you can use this to create very consistent characters between different characters and then that's what's going to take us to the third part of the tab which is the voice cloning tab now instead of using an eagle voice or david's voice which are generated voices you can use your own voice in speeches let's say you or your friend you can create generic speeches between you and your friend so now for you to do this all you have to do is come to the voice cloning tab and this tab is very simple to use you can see right here i created a speech 19 minutes ago that's madara speech so i'm going to be recreating that for this video so now the first thing is you can choose if you want this voice to be public unlisted or private now if this is public it's going to show right here in the discovery tab meaning everybody is going to be able to see the voice that you have cloned if you come to newest right here you can see a lot of people creating their own voices you can see Luke right here you can see John C you can see Sunil from India you can see like a lot of people's voices so when you come to the voice cloning tab you can choose if you want your voice to be public or you want this to be private so I'm going to pick in private and then you can create a cover image if you want so for the cover image i'm going to be using this madara uchi as image so you can just center that and then i'm going to tap on save now you can enter the voice note this is going to be madara 2 
and then you are now going to upload the file and make sure your file is between or it's at least above 10 seconds so if you upload an audio file that is uh below the 10 second mark it is not going to be able to generate so make sure your voice is above 10 seconds and you can see there is a check mark right here that isolates your voice meaning if there's background noise in your audio if there's cars moving by if there's music in the background it's going to isolate your voice for better mimicry so now we're going to be dropping our audio file we're going to be using this madara's audio file and then we just tap on create okay guys you can see uh there's the madara to right here so it's as easy as that you can just record voices and then you can come right here and then you can build those voices for consistency so now here is something that makes fish audio even more powerful what makes it more powerful is it comes with api support that means that even if you're a developer or you're just a bit tech savvy you can also plug fish audio directly into your own apps websites or both so if you're a developer this is going to be very useful for you and now like i said before you can use the fish audio platform for free you can see the free plan like right here the free tier gives you one hour of voice generation per month you get the standard generation speed and then you get around three minutes per clip but if you get the premium plan you get all of these just buffed up so the premium plan is way better than a free tier if you guys want to get the premium plan make sure you use the code shown on the screen right now i'm also going to be putting it in the comment section and i'm also going to be putting it in the description of this video so basically guys that's all about the fish audio platform if you guys have any issues using the fish audio platform make sure you hit me up in the comment section below or you hit the fish audio support team directly and they are going to assist you with any issues you have if you guys haven't subscribed to the channel kindly hit that subscribe button right now and make sure you also tap on the bell icon so that you get notifications to know whenever a new video is uploaded to this channel thank you guys for watching and i'm going to catch you guys in the next one